With Thanksgiving in the rearview mirror, we are heading straight for Christmas. And as many of us are holiday shopping, many others are turning to DIY. In this week's Make It Monday, we're putting together a gift that is a great option even for beginning sewers. You may have seen pillows just like this sold in stores, on Pinterest, or in the latest holiday catalogs. It's called a drop cloth pillow, and it's actually really easy and low cost to make. Wendy Zock with Artisans in Greenville is showing us the way. Here's what you'll need. A drop cloth, decorative fabric for ruffle, pillow stuffing, and basic sewing tools. This project can be done by hand if you don't have a sewing machine. For this demonstration, though, Wendy pre-cut everything and is showing us step by step. First, get your drop cloth. You can get a lot of cloth for really cheap if you go to a home improvement or tool supply store. And then you're going to want to wash it one to two times. If, if you wash it with bleach, it's going to change the color. So if you wanted kind of a lighter pillow, then you would definitely want to bleach it a few times. Once you have the color you want, cut to the size you want. Wendy cut hers to 16 by 13. You'll want two pieces of cloth at the same size and then cut a smaller portion for the ruffle to hang off of. The next thing you're going to want to do is create your ruffle. For this, use a gathering stitch on the decorative fabric. Once you're done, sew the ruffle onto the smaller portion of fabric and leave a couple inches of fabric at the top. You're going to want to roll that over just so you have kind of a gathered okay. pleat there. Um, we pin it on each side just to make sure we can keep mm -hmm. it even and then what you're going to want to do is just stitch right along to connect those. Next, choose where you want the ruffle on your pillow. We will eventually flip the pillow inside out, so place the ruffle side down first on one of the remaining pieces of cloth. You just want to kind of tuck this in. Okay. You're going to stitch right along there. Then get the last piece of cloth and place it on top. So you're going to just line up your edges perfectly and then you like I said you're just going to tuck that in and you're going to just sew right along the edges and you want to leave a three inch probably two to three inch opening. Cut a little off the corners so your edges are round and not pointy. When you're done turn it inside out, stuff, sew it closed and you have yourself the perfect DIY gift. Now if you want to add a little more to the pillow you can sew on extra buttons or even lace to jazz it up. You can make several of these for only about $20 total. That's your Make It for this Monday. For other Make It ideas any day of the week, follow me on Pinterest by searching Maria WNCT. You can also follow along on Snapchat, Facebook, and Instagram.